Hey guys, Retro Badger here. A big thank you to the Angry Pirates for his donation to the channel. This video is for you. Hopefully, you won't be angry with the results. The Angry Pirates would like to see if it's possible for a Federation shuttlecraft to go up against two Romulan, the Derek's class warbirds. We've discussed possible tactics, one of them is flying in the middle and maybe drawing fire from the other warbird. He has had success going against one warbird in a standard shuttle. This is going to be tricky. Okay, here we go. So I'm going to go instantly to in system warping, I think. Hang on, let's get him a bit closer. Yeah! You know, I'm really happy we've got in-system warping because we'd be in serious trouble without it. Oh, hang on. What, what, what? Oh gosh, that's close. Ah, one of them's cloaked. Okay. That's gonna be hmm, easier and harder at the same time. I can't believe they've both cloaked like that. Oh, here we go. Pesky Romulans. Whoa! That was close. Alright, let's try and fly in the middle of the warbird. Oh gosh, that was close. You know, a single one of those might take us out. I don't want to fly in front of that thing. Let's give him something to think about. Oh, look at that! Well, it'd be rude not to. Interesting how the other warbird is still cloaked. Oh! Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa! Oh, I love in-system warping. It is the best thing ever. That would be on my absolute wish list for Bridge Commander Remastered, but... I'm not sure if it would cause serious instabilities in the game. Oh, hang on. Come on. Whoop. Yeah! See, look at that! As soon as you get close to them, they cloak. They're sneaky, these Romulans, aren't they? I'm not picking up anything else, Captain. Oh! Ah! I may have to use another type of shuttle in a minute. Yeah, see, the problem is... Our forward shield is draining. We can only take a few shots. And then we're disabled. These shuttles are way too weak. Needs to get closer, needs to get closer, come on. Aha! We've got a blind spot. Let's fly in! Come on, fly in, fly in! I'm just gonna go for it. Full speed! Ah, come on! Ah! Approximately 10 hours later. Okay, well, it's still a shuttlecraft, but a rather special shuttlecraft. This is the only realistic way I can see that we're gonna get inside the Romulan Warbird, basically without being blown up in a second. Oh, right. So, time for some piloting here. Oh, f Time to fly into the belly of the beast. I hope this worked. Ooh, the Romulans won't like this. Ah oh gosh, this, what, they've cloaked? Oh my goodness. That is not a good time for them to cloak only I could get in the middle while the other one fires. This is good. They've... So they are firing at us. Oh, come on! Right, that should slow them down, hopefully. So... Now... <laughs> oh, gosh, no! Ah! Okay, plan D. So, what I'm gonna do is disable one of the warbirds, fly in the center of it, and see if the other warbird attacks us while we're inside that one. Which is what the objective of this video is supposed to be. Of course, doing it in an actual battle seems next to impossible. That sounds like plasma weapons. Okay. Let's track to them. Our tractor is not working. Ah, uh, goody! Can we even keep up with them, actually? Okay, we need to reduce their speed somehow. Hmm. 
If I fly right at them... There we go. Right, I can deal with that speed, I think. I think... Oh, gosh. Hang on. Ah! That inertia is a... Come on, come on, come on, come on! Fly in the... Fly in the middle, fly in the middle, come on! Do -do -do -do. Also, the warbird is speeding up again. How? All right, we got him. So. So, so, so. Oh. Okay. Slight collision there. We're okay. Now, it's... Oh, flippin' heck. Okay, so. I thought of a way of making this possible. What I'm going to do is disable a friendly warbird. There we go. That should have... Yep, we've got their impulse engines. And we'll now fly in the center. Although, annoyingly, they're moving as well. Hmm, hang on. Ah, no effects. And we'll summon a enemy warbird. And can I maintain being in the center of this <laughs> giant warbird? I almost think we're going towards the planet, you know, because I'm moving at 279 kph here. Oh, they've launched a shuttle. What's this? Unknown ship. Interesting. We're going to hit. Well. Ah, uh, I would hazard. Oh. F I would hazard a guess and say that the Romulan ship was indeed firing at us then, because when the warbird was out of the way, the torpedoes flew at us. So I think the warbird was actually targeting us through the other warbird. I'm going to try it again though, and see if I can repeat the science experiment. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh. Uh, let's see. We're in. Yeah, now I think about it, there's plenty of room in here. Right, let's try and... Oh, yeah, 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 they are, they're targeting us. Whilst hurting the other... Sugar! Warbird! Oh, gosh, this is hard. I just uh, banged into the wall there. Hope Commander Tomalock isn't on the toilet again. Oh, hang on. Yeah, look at that! They're firing at us through the warbird! Oh, crumbs! Well, Mr. Pirate, I don't think it's possible to do under combat conditions. There's just too many variables. However, we have at least proved that it is possible. Although I do think the odds of pulling this off are the same as Quark donating his money to charity and allowing his employers time off work. Well, I hope you all enjoyed that idea by the Angry Pirate. I certainly had a lot of fun trying that out. Thanks for watching and bye for now.